Say me. We have 11 million more Americans at risk of losing their homes once these COVID protections expire. Now, the federal government supercharging the U.S. consumer with now a periodic I'm massive stimulus payment. We have this 900 oh, billion and this 1.9 trillion that have been laid out in the people. This rolls out the talk of universal basic income and handouts. And when you have people that have been broken down, their jobs taken away, and have nothing, well, they're going to take anything that they can get. And that seems to have been all part of this. Now, they're saying that the government is now responsible for a staggering 27% of all personal income. And as I talked about with this moratorium that was going to be going out and all these people are going to be put in the street. This is just a wave of millions that continue to suffer. So we have loss of jobs, no new jobs. We have robots and everything else replacing them. And then we have the government just wanting to get handouts. So this doesn't seem to be like a really good formula here. So sending prayers out to everyone out there dealing with these situations that are facing losing their jobs, their home, and everything. It's a nightmare. And I gotta give a shout out to everyone out there that does something that helps others. Join me on the live streams where I break this down further. Much love. I recommend Weebles to my family all the time. Hey, Shalom, Shalom, Shalom. Hey, first and foremost, we would love to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who taught us this truth, and uh, blessings and uh, respect to all the Akim out there pushing his word and truth and sincerity across the four corners of the earth, putting your freedom and lives at risk, standing up in great boldness for the name Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. All right? And, uh, you know, basically, man, you know, things are about to get real, man. And I, I believe that it is it, it expires, uh, I want to say, March the 14th. It might be later. It might be sooner. You know, but, you know, once that happens, man, all right, shit, excuse my language, is going to get real, man. And ultimately, man, this is the devil, man. He, he, this is this is unrighteous, man. All right. Uh, this is a, a unrighteous decree that this devil has, you know, put forth, man, because, hey, man, this whole pandemic is started because of it be, uh, be, because of him man and his greed man and what he wants to accomplish man so here it is this whole uh c19 madness man okay was 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 baloney okay in order to help you further your agenda okay and you're actually gonna you know let uh, uh people be evicted man that's an unrighteous decree man let me grab this real quick out then you can grab that proverbs this is uh isaiah 10 and 1 it says woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees and that have right grievousness, which they have prescribed, man. Okay. And that's Esau. Woe unto you, man. Death unto you, man. Okay. F for all these unrighteous decrees, man. Every every uh, law this devil has put forth has been unrighteous, man, because it is not bagged up by the uh by the scriptures, man. Okay. And, and for you to allow, you know, uh people to uh be taken out of their home. All right, due to the fact of them not having a work, due to the fact of companies shutting down, due to the fact of this C-19, which you created in your uh, CDC uh, uh, laboratories, man, okay? That is an unrighteous decree, man, because the scriptures speak against that. You want to grab that up? This is the book of Proverbs, chapter 22, and verse 27. It says, if thou hast nothing to pay... Why should he take away thy bed from under thee? That's right, man. So if a person don't have uh, 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 the money to pay, okay, you're not supposed to kick them out of their house, man. Okay, you're not. Hey, even with the uh, with, the, with the vehicles, man. You know, a person uh, uh, may may not have the the the, 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 the amount of money to pay their car note for the month, man. Okay, you 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 repo their car from them, man. You you kick them out of their house, man. But see, it's even more wicked. When the reason why people are not able to pay uh, their rent is due to the C-19. Can you bring that back one more time, Bubba Kasha? Okay, this is the book of Proverbs, 
chapter 22 and verse 27. It says, if thou hast nothing to pay, why should he take away thy bed from under thee? Right, and that's what's about to happen, okay? That is what uh, what, what's about to happen, man. A lot of you people out there are going to be, you know, cast out of your homes, man, okay? And, and, and see, man, you know, a lot of you people deserve it, man, because you to put your... Yo, 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 your trust and your faith in, 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 uh, uh, in E, okay? And it says, Isaiah 30 and 3, Therefore shall the strength of Pharaoh be your shame, and the trust in the shadow of Egypt your confusion, man. A lot of you people put all of your trust and faith in this damn devil, man, and he's about to let a lot of you people down, okay? That's Matter right. of fact, let's let, let get the book of Sirach real quick. Uh, Ecclesiastes 13, I'm going to start at... Um, for if thou be for his prophet, he will use thee. But if thou have nothing, he will forsake thee, okay? If thou have anything, he will live with thee. Yeah, he will make thee bear and will not be sorry for it, okay? So hey, this, you think this devil going to feel uh, any type of sympathy for you people out there for losing your home, man? Esau is like a wicked woman who only out for your money. That's right. She has stayed with you stay down on your side but once that well run dry she gone she gone that's e that's e so e's not gonna have any sympathy for you people man all right so who you people gonna run to man you don't want to run to the lord man okay this thing hey man it's about to get real for you people out there man hey the book of proverbs chapter one and verse 24 on down say since they refuse correction and want it not of the lord's counsel <laughs> He will laugh at them and choose they the losers against them. You feel me? That's right. So, because our people hard headed and stiff necked, man, they gotta pay the consequence, man. That's right. The second Ezra sixteen and seventy two. I'm gonna get straight to the point. For they shall waste and take away their goods and cast them out of their houses, man. This is about to happen. Okay, you people are about to be cast out of your homes, man. Okay, willingly or or they're gonna use force to do so, man. Cause a lot of these landlords, man, you know, you know, they can't go through the regular process of taking you to eviction court, man. So they're gonna take matters in their own hands, man. Okay, so hey, man, you know, you got any closing precepts? Yeah, this is the book of Micah, chapter two, verse one. It says, "Woe to them that devise iniquity and work evil upon their beds." That's these devils, man. These devils, you know. They can't go to sleep at night, man, until they came up with a, a, a evil plan, man. Okay? It's like the pinky in the brain. Every damn day, they tell this take over the damn world when the world is already in their hands. They're trying to find a way to put, put a, a tighter grip on the world, man. So these devils sit at the house, bedtime, snorting all type of cocaine, man, doing all type of drugs, thinking of more unrighteous decrees to bring forth, man. Okay? They work evil upon their beds, man. Go ahead. When the morning is light, they practice it. Right, so when these devils wake up, they put that plan that they thought about on their bed, they put that plan right into action. You know what, man? We think we're going to make uh, abortions legal, man. And then in the morning, they with the, with the stroke of a pen, man, they make it happen. It says, because it is in the power of their hands. Right, it is in the power of their hands because Job why? They're ruling right now. Job 9.24, the earth was given unto the hand of the wicked. Okay, but see, this devil... He's about to be taken out of out of that uh, out of the throne out of that throne, man. Okay, the, the the Lord is coming to cast this devil out, man. I don't know why this devil have in his mind that he's about to uh, make it through what the Lord has set up for him, man. All kind right, of, kind of comes the point right here. It says, and they covet fields and take them by violence and houses and take them away. They oppress a man and his house. Even a man and his heritage, and that's what he, that's what he is about to do, man. And that's what he does, man. We, we see we see it happen on the on a small scale, but now it's about to happen on a large scale, man. That video said eleven million people, man. You on know, top of millions of people already don't being homeless. Yeah, jobs and don't have homes and food. Shortages. No, but hey, it can happen to 
Hey, your heart right desire, you know, if, if it's if it's if it's the Lord's will, man, it don't happen to uh, you know none of us brothers, man. But hey, man, you know, let the Lord will be done because hey, man, your heart by, hey, man, that's why it's it's, it's a must. You put your trust and your faith in your heart by shimmy out with shot, man. Hey, but when they come with the mandatory jab, we gonna be living like pilgrims on the earth anyway. anyway. When they go house to house, you feel me? Like, hey, man, you took this, man, you took the jab, you took the jab. We ain't gonna be here. You feel me? Oh, that's right. To be moving around this place. Yeah, so hey man, you know, this is this is what's coming in the near future to all of you people out there, man. Hey man, and you know, to the hopeful elect man, may your high boss me always shall be with us, man. Lord willing, we are them uh individuals, man. So hey man, you had anything else up? That's it. Hey man, uh 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 we wanna get love to give all praise on the glory to your high boss me always shall by Hashem, but cock with dash, why a bot, but boy, shalom. Shalom.